All right, Halos, welcome back. Uh, we are back in Hogwarts Legacy once again, um, and we are continuing. We just uh, got it, the sorting ceremony completed in the last part, and then uh, had some interesting stuff happening for sure. Found out uh, about a goblin. Um, but yeah, either way, uh, we're back in our dormitory now. We just entered the dormitory in the very end of the previous part, and yeah, let's do it. Appleby Arrows, 1612. Interesting. All right, uh, yeah, let's let's head through our door, shall we? All right, looks like we should walk through it. All right, um, it says it wants us to go up. Well, what's down here? I like exploring. Rebellion. I think of use. There's a chest up there. Oh, hello. There's a chest over there. I don't know how to get there though. Find your common room. What is this? Oh, hello. Got some bathrooms or something. Can we... Yep, we can definitely go to the bathroom. Alright. Anyways, um... Rebellion. There's nothing secret or hidden in here, right? Oh. Some stuff down there, though. That's kind of cool looking. Wash our hands. Obviously, we can take a bath, do all the stuff. Um, you know, the usual. All right. Well, anyways, let's head back. Um, back the way we're supposed to go. I think. Oh, what's this? Aha! Oh, level three lock. I did not know they were locked. Okay. Rebellion. All right. Doesn't seem to be much in here. Anyways, let's head back up. I think. Where it wants us to go. Interesting, though. Interesting to be sure. Uh, I think that's where we came from. Yep. And then this is where it wants us to go. Oh. <laughs> this should be interesting. Hello. Guess we can't go that way. There's the common room. Introduce yourself to three people. Must be different. Starting home. That's just thing. brilliant, Ami. Brilliant! You'd think you could... Ah! That is not how that... Okay. Let's talk to him. Why, hello! Would you like to take a look? Sure. Let's do it. Can't see too much in the day. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. I'm Amit. Pleasure to have you in Ravenclaw. Never met someone who's been so close to a dragon before. Can't say I'd recommend it, frankly. It's nice to meet you, Amit. I take it you like astronomy. Oh, yes. So much to be learned from the stars. Also, there's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. It's invigorating. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. Hmm. Uh, I find the stars fascinating. I hope astronomy's on my schedule. Sounds interesting. I have good news for you. You are most definitely taking astronomy. It is required for all fifth years. You will be enthralled with the tower. Plus, a quality telescope can show you things you never dreamed of. I suppose I'll see you in class then. Yes. Oh, and speaking of class, better get to my first one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Be seeing you. <laughs> All right, fair enough. See you later. Are they gonna let him through? Oh, I can aim now. So I probably shouldn't cast magic in here, honestly. Okay, now they didn't really let him through. Hello, friends. How's everyone doing? I'm not sure this is the right spot. I'm not sure either. Let me adjust this up. Oh, cool. <laughs> Alright, um. Delicious. Let's talk to Samantha Dale. I want him to be in the perfect place. A place he'll be happy with. But I can't seem to find it. Great golden gobstones. I want him to thrive here. Golden gobstones? <laughs> My own little expression. I bought this Dittany seedling from home and I so want him to feel cozy. Dittany is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. 
I have a bit of a thing for plants, as you can see. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. Is Disney used in Wiganwell Potion? It is. Looks like someone's been studying up on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about the Wiganwell Potion. Of course. I heard you were studying with him before term. He's an enigma, Fig. Teaches about theory, it seems to know a lot about practical magic. <laughs> He's quite knowledgeable. Oh, wait, where's my mouse? There we go. Professor Fig does know a great deal about, um, different forms of magic. Well, I hope he told you about more than Wiganweld. You've lots to catch up on, I'm sure. Um, let's see. Do most students grow their own ingredients? Excuse me. Is it common practice for students to grow their own ingredients? Oh, yes. In fact, our herbology teacher, Professor Garlic, encourages it. And I don't think Professor Sharp, our potions master, cares where you get your ingredients, as long as your brews are all perfect. Mm, interesting. Isn't it Hufflepuffs who like plants? An affinity for herbology is more typical of a Hufflepuff than a Ravenclaw, isn't it? Ordinarily, perhaps. But it runs in my family. We've a full plot of these little fellows back home. I suppose you could say herbology is in my roots. <laughs> Alright, nice talking with you. It was nice to meet you, Samantha. Good luck with your Disney. Thank you. And good luck to you too on your first day. <laughs> Alright, um... Revelio. Ooh, got some sort of chest here. Another one of those boys. That's where <laughs> we came from, I think. We should talk to him for sure. Um, I'm quickly check out this other stuff though. What is this? Assuming this is a lock. Oh, okay, it's red, so I'm assuming we should probably not do anything there. Just have to wait for the right moment. Oh. Okay. The game just froze. Sorry about that, guys. That was a little crazy. All right. Let's spin this bad boy. All right, I think we're all right. Anyways, uh, that was kind of weird. Interesting looking statue here. All right, well I don't want to explore, but let me let me go ahead and talk to her or er, him real quick. At the right moment. Wonder if she... no, that doesn't do it. All right. <clears throat> One moment. Watch this. Ugh. What is this? Could someone throw a dumbbell? <laughs> <laughs> Let's get out of here. That wasn't quite the reaction I wanted. Oh well. Right. What did you hope would happen? I suppose I hoped it would lighten the mood. Ravenclaws can be a bit on edge the first day of class. I'm Everett, by the way. You seem downright calm next to some of these characters. And you survived a rather harrowing trip here. <laughs> uh, yeah. I'm looking forward to my first day. I'm glad to be here. Ready for classes to start. Good. Glad to hear it. Truly, there's no reason to be nervous. Most professors are firm, but fair. I mean, not all of the tricks I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb, and I'm still here. Wait, did you say most professors are firm, but fair? Ha, <laughs> I did. But probably best I let you judge for yourself. I do tend to push their limits. I should wander off before someone traces that dung bomb back to me. <laughs> nice meeting you. You too, Everett. <laughs> okay. Hey there, new Ravenclaw. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You had best not keep her waiting. All right, sounds good. Revelio, Lumos, Protego. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, what is up here, if anything? Oh, it's a lock. Probably shouldn't be breaking into things, to be honest. Uh, what is this? Oh, water paper, I guess we can destroy. Oh, hello. Revelio. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> I didn't expect that one to be honest. Um, nothing really in here. All right. Um, we'll go back down there in a second. I just want to kind of explore a little bit. Another lock. Oh, this one's a level one, but I don't think we should be breaking into stuff like I said. I if I like Professor Weasley or Professor Hecate more. Hecate. No. Oh, they're both brilliant. I 
I tried interacting with the piano there, but it didn't seem to do anything. That's time around, at least. Maybe in the future. Um, spin that bad boy. All right, let's let's go to where it wants us to go. Let's, let's head over. It's clearly that we aren't allowed to go that way yet. That's fine though. I wish there was something I could do to stand up to the headmaster. Like the best to keep We're my walking head down. Now. There we go. All right. <clears throat> oh, hello. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Here you are. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. <laughs> it sounds good. <laughs> Just disappears. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Alright. Sounds good. Follow Professor Weasley. This way. We fancy we the guide will, will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Alright, fair enough. Hello, Governor. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Indeed. Why don't you cast Revelio on this bust and see what <laughs> details the field guide can provide? All right, Revelio. Oh, field guide page, collect, okay. Ravenclaw bust, guide pages. This bust created in uh, honor of Raven House, Ravenclaw House resides in the lofty Ravenclaw Tower. All right, straight up, plus 80 XP, nice. You just unlocked a field guide challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Oh, collect field guide pages, one of two. Uh, and Hogwarts, field guide challenges are the only way to acquire experience points or XP, oh. Way, okay. This is your wiz wizarding level. Uh, XP earned from challenges increases your level and power. Your field guide tracks your current challenge progress. So select the challenges menu to continue. Oh, okay. Let's click on it. Uh, collecting your first guide page unlocked a new challenge category. The new challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Select field guide pages to continue. Alright, uh, gear appearance reward, Hogwarts Regalia Spectacles, nice. Uh, each challenge has tiers, Re special rewards lock at each, each tier you complete, from appearances to critical upgrades. Uh, rewards must be claimed for the challenges menu, come back often to collect rewards you have unlocked. Alright. Sounds good. Um, Revelio. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. Okay. Sounds good. Hello, friends. So cool. <laughs> Sorry, I was just admiring your, uh, your moving pictures, paintings, art. No time to waste. You have classes to attend. Indeed, indeed. Rebellion. We've got some stuff we can check out here real quick, actually. One second, sorry. Oh, shoot. Can I search this? Can I roll that? Interesting. Huh. 
Huh. Interesting. Alright, I'm not sure what those do, but I'm sure it's something. Revelio. Oh, 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 wait, hold up. So we need that, and we need spider. Okay. So that one's already done, I need a spider over here. Sorry, please don't hurt me. Here we go. That should do it, right? No. Okay. Question mark? Thirteen twenty-one, so thirteen. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. <coughs> Spider plus one equals thirteen. So twelve, that question mark is a twelve. And then thirteen plus that is uh, twenty-one. Wait, that's not a twelve actually. Hold up, what? I, I could just Maybe we'll try this? I don't know. No? Oh, hold up. Rebellion. If we assume this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, then the spider would be a 9 plus 1. Um, it's a 10, obviously, so the 3 would be that, whatever that is. Maybe? Let's try it, I guess. Hmm, I don't know, actually. Maybe do the question marks. No, question marks didn't do it. Oh, there it is. Right? Yeah, yeah. That's... That didn't do it, though. Um, then this other one needs to be... Two, three, four plus thirteen is seventeen. So he's nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. So four again. So yeah, it would have to be that, right? Try that. See if that works. Otherwise, I'm just gonna skip it. All right. Yep, we tried. Um, I'm not gonna spend a long time there. <laughs> oh, T opens up a whole thing here. Okay. Stupefy. We've got Protego. Basic cast. Alright, this is stuff we can unlock, uh, evidently. Interesting. Alright, we've got a lot of stuff to learn. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Okay. Um, you discovered a flu flames fast travel point. Oh, you can open the map at any time to fast travel to any discovered flu flames. Open up the map with M. Nice. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where students and professors live. It includes the house, common rooms, and the great hall. Uh, so select the stair grand staircase region to continue. All right. Uh, in this view, you can see the flu flames available in that region. Green flu flames represent flames you have discovered, including your own house, common room. Gray flu flames reveal the location of undiscovered flames. All right. The red side of the map is where you'll find academic points of interest, including the astronomy tower, library, and uh, greenhouses. Select the library annex region to continue. Okay. Uh, Professor Lee Weasley has unlocked the Central Hall Flu Flames for you. Use AD to rotate the map and fast travel to the Central Hall Flu Flames. With spacebar, okay. Central Hall.
And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. That's cool. Alright, um, sweet. Follow Professor Weasley. Can I go back to where I was a second ago? Because, uh, I would like to. No, it doesn't look like it. Not right now. Alright, currently unavailable. We'll, we'll, we'll go back for it. It's fine. Follow Professor Weasley. Let's do it. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. <coughs> right. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Uh, Alright, cool. What's Hogsmeade? You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Alright, what exactly is Defense Against the Dark Arts? Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. Alright, uh, can you tell me more about Charms class? What will I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard, and a talented teacher. Alright, thank you, Professor. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Um, there is, in fact. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... Oh, I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Speak of the devil. <laughs> Professor Fig, your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Alright, sounds good. Uh, we should talk to Professor Fig. Um, should I do that right now? Or can I fast travel now? Uh, no, this is unavailable still. So let's talk to Professor Fig then. Uh, is there anything around here that I can quickly Rebellion. check out though? Oh, hello, what's this? 
Lumos. Protego. Revelio. Revelio. Look around real fast. If there's anything worthwhile. Oh my gosh, there's a dragon going off up there. I didn't even realize that. That's kind of cool. Alright, uh, yeah, I think we're good actually. Let's go ahead and talk to him. Um, actually, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and save here, and I'll catch you guys in the next video, because this one's running a little bit long. Thank you guys for watching once again. Uh, let me know if you want to see longer videos or shorter videos. I'll try to do either one. Um, but yeah, we'll see. Catch you later. Peace.